These are our self-irrigating planters. And just to give you an idea before I fill this one up, you'll be able to see what's inside of them. I have a four inch perforated drainage hose lining the inside. I have an overflow, that's the little white pipe on the side, and then a fill, a three inch PVC fill pipe with a, as you can see the cap there is also, cap works great for covering the fill pipe. So I'll fill this now with mulch that I got from the dump for free. And then I'll put some dirt that you can see over there in a pile on top of that. And then in back there, way back there, on the other side of the uh, propane tank, um, is my compost, which I'll be putting about a four inch layer of compost on top. Uh, uh, the thing is, is you definitely want to use a thick tarp, like this is a 10 mil tarp. I started off using a 2 mil drop cloth. Needless to say, the drop cloth was in here, got pulled out and replaced. Of course, I didn't discover that until after I had this all full, so it's a pain in the ass getting it drained out, emptied out. But now, all I have to do now with this one is to fill it with dirt and then put some plants in it. And this one's going to be the, the uh, strawberry planter. Again, this is our garden for 2023. Raised beds at the back of the house. Um, anyhow, this is our project for this year. Thank you for watching. Bye.